Bank Island is a tremendous asset in the city. What it does is it reaches out to folks that are not banked right now, or they might be underbanked, and teaches them about the value of having a bank account to establish some stability in their savings, to establish uh, credit as well so they can make further investments in their life if they want, but mainly to build a culture of financial empowerment. And it's resulted in tremendous uh, progress for the city. 13,000 families now are banked that weren't banked before, and that's led to all types of good things for them. Well, I used to save money when I was younger, much younger. Sort of got off track, the kids got older and gone out of the way, and felt like I didn't have to save our like I used to, but by being in this program, I, I'm more mindful about what I, how I spend. I was never taught the responsibility of credit cards, so once I went to college, I got a lot of credit cards, and Bank on Louisville actually gives you a chance to uh, learn the pros and cons to credit cards and good credit worthiness and uh, checking and savings. What happens is if you're not banked, you end up spending almost $40,000 over the course of your lifetime on fees. And to hear people talk about it with the pride in their voices about having money in the bank, it's an accomplishment and it's a stepping stone for them. I now have a savings account, I have a checking account, I have a secured card, my son has a savings account. I have money in the bank now, okay? <laughs> I was thinking about saving. The Bank on Louisville program worked out really well for me. I mean, I was able to manage my finances better with a bank account. And as I said, I got a great relationship with the bank that I chose. Now I have a little bit more money left out of the month. When you see the amount of money you could save, then it's all worth it. I'm really glad that I took part in the program. To learn more about Bank On, it's easy. Just visit bankonlouisville.org or just call 574-5156.